Brian Jackson, editor at ID World Canada here. This is the self-driving cars area at CES, and there's a lot on display here. A lot of concept cars, a lot of cars in development, but this one right behind me here from Toyota really caught our attention when they said they'd be working with Pizza Hut to deliver pizzas to people at the 2020 Olympics in Tokyo. So I had to learn all about it. Let's listen in. So Pizza Hut's exploring all sorts of options, whether it's just a delivery vehicle with somebody that's kind of more focused on hospitality, bringing the pizza to the door, or whether it's baking the pizza on the way to the delivery. So that way it is fresh right out of the oven when it gets to your door. They're exploring all options right now. They've been a great partner. Pizza Hut's fantastic. So the early trials will be in Tokyo for the Olympics uh, the, that Toyota's sponsoring. That's the original plan right now. Um, when it comes to feasibility testing, we plan to start testing either 2022 or 2023 in North America. All of that is still up in the air since this is still, at this point, a concept vehicle that we're still developing. Um, but uh, we're, we're pretty excited about it. One of the other big pieces behind this is the mobility services platform. It's the software you can't see. That's live today. We're using this in Hawaii and it'll be launching in Spain this month as well. So it's a global software platform that will service this and support it behind it. One of the big reasons was space. So we plan on this being an electric vehicle, obviously that's a lot less metal inside the vehicle so we can make it a whole new shape. Uh, and that's a, the, the pallet part of it you can obviously see. It was originally just pallet and then the E was added as an artist pallet is the name for it. Uh, because we want it to be open to be configurable. So this should be configured. It could switch from being an Uber vehicle to next day delivering Pizza Hut. It doesn't matter, it could do all of those things. We plan to have it kind of open source inside so there can be things developed to hold different boxes, different size boxes, hold people, standing people, uh, wheelchairs, anything is possible with this vehicle. 